What's up everybody it's your boy super sun and i am back out here with another video so today's video will um uh it's i do believe like eight or nine in the morning so i'm gonna start it off by getting my dogs walking them for a morning stroll and then the plan for today is off the spoilers sand them down and i'm gonna spray them black same color as the trim i did i'm debating on if i want to take off the tail lights and spray these black also just so it kind of all matches and it's not that ashy gray look and if you're still wondering no i have not yet found a svo louver to match this side of the car and no i have not found a regular 86 louver for the right side of the car so with that being said i'm gonna go grab my dogs and i'll see you guys in a little bit all right so with that being said the all gray one is cookie she's two and yeah, i guess you call them all gray but with the white on the head that is Titan. He is eight months. So the reason why I wanted to make the video today is to pretty much apologize to you guys for not really giving it my all. I know I've seen like I was, but I don't know. I just felt like I, I was falling off daily. And starting a youtube it is hard don't get me wrong it is hard you have to find content every day that's going to keep people excited and at one point i almost gave up but your boy not a quitter so i'm really going to start pushing out content now i started a a wood working business with my with my brother slash uncle and I'm going to start giving that my all also. Yes, I do work, but at the same time, I do carve wood. Now, anything you guys think think of that's made from wood, we're able to do. You need signs, names, letters, and all that. I also do that too. Uh, so, my sister-in-law has asked me to do uh names for her and i've been really slacking on it but friday i'm gonna go get the wood and i'm gonna really buckle down and get on it and uh with the mustang i'm gonna hold off on fixing up the mustang i am stop guys all right come on all right sorry i had to switch hands I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold, gonna hold off fixing the Mustangs because I just feel that I am rushing into something that I'm really not, well, I'm ready for it, but at the same time, I'd rather have other things before just dishing out my money for the Mustang. So the Mustang is gonna be on hold but yet at the same time, I'm still gonna be pushing out content about the Mustang. I'm still gonna be pushing out content about the woodworking. And I'm still gonna be pushing out content about me trying to start my own uh, photography business. Now, if you know me, you know I love taking pictures, always have, always will. So with that being said, now, not not only do i need a vlogging camera i'm also going to need a good quality camera to take pictures and i'm also going to need a good laptop where i'm able to upload everything so my next instead of instead of purchasing uh not purchasing but instead of fixing up the mustang right now that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna 
buy the camera equipment that I need, buy the extra batteries, buy the memory cards, and I'm also, come on Titan, no Titan. And I'm also going to buy the laptop that I've always wanted, but never really could afford until now. Now, am I taking a risk? Yes. Who goes out and spends three to four grand on laptop equipment and camera equipment when this isn't a for sure thing? Is it gonna make me money? Is it gonna bring in income? It's not about the money with me. I mainly care because I've been doing it. I mainly care because I've been doing it and I love to do it. And it's something I love to do. So money really isn't something I'm after right now. So, hey, I'm just doing what I, what I wanna do and what I love to do. So with that being said, I will see you guys once we're back at home. Alrighty, people, and just like that, I am back home. So over the little, over the little break, I guess you could say I took, I had went to Sacramento or Elk Grove, pretty much the same place, and I had purchased me some five lug wheels, uh, five lug wheels, rims. Now, the reason why I chose this style, just it's not going to be permanent but it'll be for when i just do the five look swap so i don't have to go out and dish out the money that i want for my rims because they're pretty expensive because i'm not going with any regular mustang rims i'm going with a rim that you really haven't seen on mustangs you've probably seen a few but you really haven't seen them but for the meanwhile the rims i am going with are these Alrighty, the rims that I'm going with. I'm not a huge fan of chrome, but when chrome is clean and the sun is hitting it, you know they go shine. So when I first got these rims, I don't know why I didn't record it, but when I first got the rims, it was brake dust all around the whole wheelbarrow. As y'all can see, the whole rim pretty much looked that black. So I went and bought SOS pads and I went and bought uh, mother's wheel cleaner and I sprayed them. And if y'all can tell every single wheelbarrow, well, you probably can't see it, but every single wheelbarrow has been cleaned. But the reason why I went with this rim is because you really don't see Mustangs with this ones. Either they get the Cobras, or pretty much it. They get the Cobras, they get the 97 GT rims, or they just, they just, I don't know, they get the normal Mustang rims, but I really haven't seen any five lug swap done and the Mustang had these rims on it. And my whole thing is being different being different, separating myself from all the other Fox Body Mustangs out there. And that's my whole plan. And that's what I'm sticking to it. And that's what I'm sticking to. And that's what I'm going to continue to do. I'm in my own lane. I'm going to do my own thing. I'm going to do my different thing than everybody else is doing. Yes, Papa? You like them? Yes. Thank you. But yeah, with that being said, I'm going to grab my tools. I'm going to head outside and I'm going to take off the SVO spoilers off a of star and get to sanding them. So, see you in a little bit. If it ain't about no money, money, money. If it ain't about no money, money, if it, money. If, if it ain't about no money, you ain't even got to mention me. I'm having real money, nothing y'all can say it gets to me. If it ain't about no she a breadwinner. Everything will draw when I deposit dick head in her. When I see a bad bitch, I ain't mesmerized. This game I got it from a movie, it was never televised. This shit is in me and it's on me. And I still was down to spread with top rhyming and baloney. If it ain't about no money, you wasting your time on me. And I vow to never let nobody ever shine on me. I, I done fell off hard and got shitted on. But now I'm another whole kind of different on. Now everybody need favors, I did it alone. I'm to the Adam's apple now, nigga saying I'm wrong. 
No support was all I needed, going crazy on 8 verse like I be writing for a remix, nigga Put my money first and stay on defense If it ain't about no money, truthfully that shit don't mean shit Money, 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 if it ain't about no money Money, money, if it ain't about no money, you ain't even gotta mention me I'm having real money, that y'all can say it get to me If it ain't about no money, 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 if it ain't about no money Money, money, if it ain't about no money, I give a fuck what you dummies do My niggas run through hoes, I got these hundreds, I be thumbing through If it ain't about no money, 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 if it ain't about no money Money, money, if it ain't about no money, then we probably won't talk much Won't get caught with a bitch if she ain't finna call for If it ain't about no, if it ain't about no money, I ain't tryna kick it with em Keep em at a distance, they don't really mean I'm trippin' with em Bitches love me, niggas hate me, I been that way so I embrace this shit I never let it change me so, so many niggas tryna ride wave, but really go about the whole thing sideways. They ain't support me on the come up, now I'm dumb up. Everybody think I own, got me fucked up. Accomplish anything I ever put my mind to. And as you guys can see, this is the one that stripped. This is the one that stripped. I'm gonna have to get some Teflon tape for it. But I also did not cut the OEM third brake light wiring either due to. If I did, I would have had a brake light, uh, all, all way, the brake, the rear brake light lamp would have always been on. So yeah, so now I gotta go in the house, grab my sandpaper and just start sanding. Now I have a little paint left over from when I did the bumpers, the headlights and the, the pretty much the trim. So I'm gonna sand both of them completely my bad i'm gonna sand both of them completely and then i'm gonna spray them most likely i'm gonna run out of paint but that's where i will end the video and if you like what you see already make sure you like the video you leave me a little comment and you subscribe to my youtube channel i gladly and i greatly appreciate it and for the ones that have rocked with me since day one and supported me since day one i want to say thank you guys and i appreciate you but bigger things are to come all right, so I was only able to find one uh, 400 grit sandpaper, slightly used, but it's all right. And not really much paint in here. So with that being said, I'ma just spray, I'ma just sand and spray, I'ma sand both of them. No, we're not messing with the tires. I'm gonna sand both of them, but only spray the blue one and I'm gonna keep them off the car until Friday where I could go out and I could get more sandpaper and I could get more black paint. So, yeah. Alrighty, so I got the sandpaper and I also got, and I also had sitting in hot water in the sun to warm up. If anybody is wondering, this is the paint I used to do the trimming on the car. So I'm gonna keep it the same. So I'm gonna I'm sand both of them. Well, sand as much as I can with this 400 grit sandpaper. And then I'm gonna start spraying. So hey, time lapse, here we go. This is a fully production. Strictly by the bag, we are not the same. I don't give a fuck about the fame, alright? I ain't tryna impress a nigga or a bitch. Just acknowledge me for being on my shit, alright? I might hurt driving, I ain't sleeping, plotting on the come up. Working my ass off for what I got coming, alright? Before you knock the hard work that I be putting in, and you ain't putting out, you can say your little opinion, alright? I'm strictly by the bag, we are not the same. Ain't clout chasing, I'm chasing money, not chasing fame. They front of your face and talk backwards on your name. That's why I don't fuck with rappers now, y'all do too much for fame. Selling out your people, turning on your partners, I ain't built like that. Too real for shit, why I be feeling awkward? If you fuck with me, then I fuck with you I fuck with who fuck with me That say a lot of phone fuck with you right. Stop reaching out I don't wanna do a song We ain't on the same shit Leave me the fuck alone I'm in my own league Ain't nobody put me on I did this shit by myself on my own How I'm wrong I, 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 I don't owe nobody shit How niggas acting like it You went with me then You see me blowing Now you acting like This shit come with sacrifices Buying beats instead of food So whatever you put in front of a nigga Finna get chewed I, I, Strictly by the bag We are not the same I don't give a fuck about the fame, alright? I ain't tryna impress a nigga or a bitch. Just acknowledge me for being.
be on my shit, alright? I might regret the night sleeping plotting on the come up. Working my ass off for what I got coming, alright? Before you knock the hard work that I be putting in, and you ain't putting out, you can say your little opinion, alright? You, you, you can say your little opinion, it don't matter to me. I put in that work, I never had nothing handed to me. If I fuck with you, I must see something in you. If I don't fuck with you. Alrighty, and with that being said, everything has been sanded. Everything has been sanded and smoothed out, smoothed out to the touch. That's the, this is the spoiler that attaches to the hatch. And this is the spoiler that attaches to this one. Yeah, but like I said, everything is smooth to the touch. So with that being, I mean, to smooth to the touch and with that being said, I'm about to hose it off, wipe them down, let them dry and then I'll probably spray like a thin layer over both of them so at least they both have some paint but my main focus is the blue one just in case if I want to take it out I mean if I want to take the car out I could easily spend five to ten minutes putting it back on and riding out make it look a little decent but I highly doubt I'll be driving this car until I find the other spoiler and the whole thing with the spoiler I'ma just, I'ma just, I'ma just cash out and I'ma just buy them. Uh, I tried reaching out to people, tried putting it on polls to see if anybody had any, any just laying around. I wasn't asking for free. I would pay them for it, but nobody seemed to hit me up. So, dude on eBay selling one of them for like 250 bucks. So, oh well, I'ma just cash out and do what I gotta do. Oh well, I wish I could have found them cheaper, but at the same time, I can't. So. I'm gonna just cash out for him and I'm gonna just spend the 250 for one. And yeah, that's the way I'm going. So, hey, let's get back to this time lapse. I'm gonna spray them. Uh, I'm gonna spray them, wipe them down, give them a little minute to dry in the sun. Cause as you can see, it's a beautiful day in California and let them dry. And then I'm gonna spray them with a little black. I didn't came a long way, I made it too far to turn back A lot of shit don't deserve a reaction I ain't concerned with that, I ain't going back I hear they talking, when I press they won't confirm it They ain't meant enough to say the shit to me, I'm still learning Not to be so quick to jump outside my character I ain't got shit to prove, I'm just breaking down these barriers All this weight I'm carrying is getting heavier I got too much to lose, they wanna witness I won't let them, I ain't letting up I, I, I got a lot of people who depend Alrighty and just like that they have been sanded sprayed so i'ma i do believe i'm gonna uh i'm gonna take these out of the sun let them cool down and then i'll spray them i don't i don't want to spray them when they hot but at the same time it's only a temporary a temporarily thing so it pretty much really don't matter so yeah i'm gonna prop you guys up i'm not gonna prop you guys up i'm gonna hold you guys now so shake it like a salt shaker first coat went on thin front side and the back side I know you really can't see it but it did same goes with the blue one sprayed a thin coat on there just to get it sticking front and the back side so with how hot it is out here the paint's drying really fast so I'll probably count to like 10, 20 seconds after recording this. So it'll probably be a few minutes. And then I'ma I'm just focus on the blue one now. Because like I said, I want the blue one covered completely with black. But like I said, it's not getting put back on the car until Friday. Well, not Friday. Well, yeah, probably uh, probably Friday, Friday afternoon. <sighs> as soon as I wake up, take the dogs for a walk and come back and go to O'Reilly's, get more sandpaper, get more paint, and then they'll be done. 
I'm all done. The upper wing is actually coming out. It's actually coming out better than I thought. I had enough paint to cover the top of it. And the little lever. But once you come to the back, you still see the blue. And also underneath. Yeah. But like I said, on the top, I just left with a with a little base coat. Yeah, and with that being said, just like the end of the paint, this is the end of the video. Uh, I must say it again. I appreciate you guys, the ones that have been rocking with me, the ones that have been watching my channel. And uh, if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, like the videos, leave me a little comment. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, my Instagram name is supersun underscore PT2 S U P E R S O N underscore PT2. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you all. I love you all and peace out.